The Big Ten football season has pretty much gone as expected. Northwestern and Indiana both leading their divisions at 4-0 and with Penn State and Michigan combined for 1-7, and just like we all expected, right? Well, at least Iowa has somewhat gotten back on track to normalcy, winning their second game in a row on Saturday. As for the Hawkeyes' next opponent, the aforementioned Penn State will host Iowa on Saturday with an 0-4 record fresh off Nebraska, picking up their first win of the season over the Nittany Lions on Saturday. That record is tied for the worst in program history, with the only other time that Penn State was winless came in its first four games in 2001. But as with any team that has underachieved like the Lions have, the expectation is that eventually they'll get on track, and Iowa head coach Kirk Ferentz is hoping that that doesn't happen this week. It just doesn't add up, you know, especially when you watch the film. So... Does, doesn't it add up at football? You know, you've heard me say it before. Football is a strange game. You just never uh, can predict everything's going to happen. To to go through what all of us have gone through over the last couple of months, it's really hard to describe. It's just been very different, very unusual. So I think I think that just kind of you cast a shadow over this whole season, quite frankly. Um, you know, I mean, if you just got an awesome team and and you got all kinds of depth, then it's really not that big a deal. And there's there's a handful of teams like that in the country, but. Uh, I think once you get past that group of people, it's it's really you know hard to say what's going to happen or was predict what's going to happen. A 2:30 kickoff this Saturday for the Hawkeyes and Nittany Lions. Iowa looking to get their first win versus Penn State in a decade, having lost their last six matchups.